Hello everybody and welcome to another video. Today I actually have a tack haul for you. I have a few things that I have had to get for the horses and because it was a decent amount I decided I'd show you all what I got. So let's check it out. <laughs> So the first thing I got is actually this rope halter and um, it looks kind of crazy right now. But um, this rope halter comes with a 12 foot lead attached. It is by Weaver and it's the silver tip halters. Um, the reason that I ended up with this is because I had one before that had a really long lead and um, I was doing something with Dash and I tied him up and something freaked him out. Oh, I think I was trying to put on a fly mask and he reared and sat back on his butt and broke the halter, like snapped it in one of the places that there was no way I was going to repair it. Um, it was the only one I had with the long lead rope attached and it wasn't like I could just take the lead rope off and put it on something else. So I decided I needed to get a new one and I'm super excited to use it. There's so many different things you can use it for. I really enjoy doing some lunging either in the round pen or just out in the grass, this is a very useful item to have. Next up, I actually ordered this Apple Elite. It is an electrolyte supplement. And um, the reason that I purchased this is because I noticed that both of my boys seem to be very drained this summer. Um, a lot of sweat and a lot of salt. You could see it up on top of their butts and their backs. And so the reason that I ordered this, I'm just gonna try it out. Um, is because this is from Farnham. Um, it's just to um, see if maybe this might help in any kind of way. I know right now we're getting ready to go into the cold season and this is kind of dying off with the hot season, but we're gonna give it a try and see what it does. All right, next I ordered these Martin Saddlery. Um, these are barrel reins and as you can see, they're not very long. They're the knotted and braided. I really like the knotted. Not everybody does. I just do. It helps me keep track of my reins being even and things like that. But I've needed a good set of barrel reins, leather ones. I have some nylon braided reins, but these are really good for um, competition. And they also get a lot shorter than the other barrel reins. And that's one thing that I needed. So I'm really excited to try these out. Um, and I think they'll look really good with my tack. The next thing I ordered was a refill on my Equinity supplement. And this I was using for a long time for Buddy and I started using it with Dash as well. It's more of the high end stuff. Now, let me tell you something. This stuff right here has been amazing for Buddy or it was when Buddy was around. Um, he had a lot of issues with his knees and with arthritis and stuff. And a lot of the things I would give him, they just didn't make that big of a difference. Now, he wasn't perfect on this. It wasn't like some miracle and he had no problems at all. But it definitely made a difference between the time I started it and the time um, that it was used up till with him. He definitely walked better. Um, it didn't seem like such a chore for him. But as you know, Buddy had plenty of problems with his arthritis and his knees. So walking was not that enjoyable anyway but this stuff made it to where it was comfortable enough that he was able to get around, he was able to canter, do all kinds of stuff. So I would have to say I really like this stuff and I've been using it for a while and I will continue to use it until I find something that maybe is better. All right, next up, I ordered these horse bell boots from Equus Secured. And um, I think that's how you say it. I ordered these because Okay, you can see they're kind of like the cloth material. They're a little more comfortable. And um, the reason that I ordered these was because Dash has a weird walk. His back feet tend to reach up and hit the back of his front feet. And the problem with that is it wouldn't be that big of a deal if it weren't for the fact that he had shoes on. So these things just go around the front feet 
and prevent his back feet from pulling off his front shoes. And that was the problem we were having. Um, you could even hear um, when he had back shoes on, they would click, the metals would click together where his back shoes were actually hitting the back of his front foot and the back of his front shoes. So these things just protect them. Um, I read the reviews and they said they ordered, they had to order them a size larger. So these are extra large. Dash normally wears large. Um, and they do look kind of small, but we're gonna see how they work out. Hopefully these will be a little bit more comfortable. The reason I ordered these was because the leather ones can kind of rub raw around um, his ankles. And so I just wanted to do something a little bit more comfortable. So we'll see how these do. Um, hopefully he won't lose them within the first week because that has happened with some of the rubber ones. And last but not least, I ordered myself a leather over under whip and this is by Congress Leather, Kingsville, Ohio. Uh, and the reason that I bought this is because whenever I'm not using my um, split reins, which have that extra bit of length at the end that I can use to kind of just not really necessarily hit him, just kind of wave them and he gets the idea like, hey, we need to pay attention. So instead, I can use this whenever I'm using, for example, my barrel reins to be able to give that signal without having those extra length of reins. So it'll be really interesting to see how these work or how this works and how he does with it. Um, I think it's going to be a lot easier to use. Anyways, guys, that is it for now. That's my little tech haul. Um, I typically buy things very um, sporadically. I don't buy a whole bunch at once because um, if you don't know, buying horse stuff is kind of expensive. So I try not to buy more than a couple things at a time. So when I do, I try to bring a tech haul for y'all just to give you a little video, kind of show you what I'm spending. Well, not the exact amount, but just how I'm spending it and what I'm spending it on. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, and we'll see you next time. Bye, guys. So, we'll see how these goes. Hope We'll see how these go. We'll see how these do. Anyway, guys. Anyways, good Lord, have mercy. What the heck is wrong with my mouth?